Nike has be throwing slip ons. You got a strong build, like the toe cap is just like any other toe cap. Like it's really good, strong, it's solid. The outsole, the midsole is really thin. The bottom's good. That back end is canvas. It's really thin and it's lightweight. And I guess that's cool for some people, not for me. Which is pretty much the point of slip ons from what I can tell. Just lightweight, broken in out the box. I'm not with it, but these skate just like any other Nike. It's strong, phenomenal, and all that good stuff. And it ain't gonna last long though. Just like any other Nike for me. That being said, it, it skates exceptionally well. It just skates like any other Nike shoe. It's not exactly like a, a Janowski, but it does have like that, that strong build in that base. Like when you put it on, you feel the quality that is Janowski's, except Janowski's ain't that type of quality. You know what I'm saying? If you skate Nikes, you skated Nikes, you're going to like these if you like slip ons. Skates just like any other Nike shoe. Really good, solid, phenomenal. Broken in, out the box, and all these other things. But ninety dollars, nigga. Ninety dollars, really? Ninety fuck for this shit, nigga. For this, shit? <laughs> nigga. I'm on some average consumer shit. I'm, I'm too broke, nigga. I ain't gonna pay no ninety fucking dollars for this shit, nigga. But if you like Nike, you're gonna like these. Is what I'm saying. I'm rambling. Still in there, we still in there. We still in here. That's 30 of them. That is wearing away, that is wearing away. Look at my hands is already fucked up, dude. Shit won't even hurt if I can probably just squeeze it. <laughs> Nigga. Nigga. I'm going to the hospital, nigga.
down here from there, nigga. There's not enough energy in my body to even comb my hair, nigga. So I believe I got 10 more to do, but I, I at least missed 10, so. Here's 100th worth of damage right here. The midsole's still holding up pretty strong. Except for that little part right here that's starting to rip up. Talk has feel pretty good. Um, God damn, nigga. God damn. Bottom's good. Toe cat's pretty cool. I mean, after 100, that's not that bad. The problem for me personally, because I do like 100 kickflips at least within a week. Like, I do like at least 20 a day. 20 a day, five days a week of skating. You can, you can, you can, I'm pretty sure you motherfuckers do a lot more kickflips than you. Probably not. Kickflips are annoying. I get mad because I can't do them so good. You can see the damage. I hope you're looking at the damage. You ain't listening to me ramble, cause that'd be ridiculous. But that is like a substantial amount of wear. Nothing too crazy, I would say. It just depends on how you skate and how long you skate a day and how often you skate, you know what I'm saying? So you can take away with it what you want from it. 